I'm moving out of my house. Put all your stuff away and check out for the day. There's no time to waste when it's 100 degrees. Burns under my feet. Won't you have a drink with me? Hey besties, uh, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today, if you guys don't already know this, I'm moving out of my house officially. So I'm going to be, um, what's that thing called? I'm going to be apartment hunting today this is my first time going apartment hunting i was meant to do this like last week but i wasn't feeling too good but i want to get it out of the way and hopefully get it done this month god's willing and yeah because of the whole thing that happened with the bats let's go house hunting i know i look like a mom right now but let me show you how i'm gonna look <laughs> so this is basically how i'm gonna look with my shades but let's see how it goes i Pinned my hair up. I don't know if I should let it down, pin it up, but I'm loving this right now. So let's just go and see what's up. So my the first place I'm going to is Ikate. Um yeah, so okay. Oh the two bed. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, and it's always clean, right? Yes. I'm sorry. If it was inside the house and hair, but like outside. Good afternoon. Hi, good afternoon. Apologies. Okay. <laughs> yeah, how did you know? That's how I was like, okay. And then there's space for the fridge, that's good. Can I see what that thank you? Yeah, this won't really be put to use. Was this any of the thank you? Guest it is the guest toilet. <gasps> Thank you. Oh, that was really painful. Thank you. Okay. Wow, this is really small. Is this the masters or? Okay, the bathroom is not bad at all. Is really nice. Ah, so then I want the executive because ah, the wardrobe space, everything is just a bit like. And this view is not really. I don't think. I think that other one was the master's. Yeah, I think that one was slightly bigger. This view is a bit like. You can literally throw up. Okay, okay. let's see other ones. This staircase is a huge no. The rooms are too small. <laughs> Sorry. So sorry. I'm sorry, I don't like it. Yeah, it's giving me bad vibes. Yeah, the kitchen is already a big no. But this will require like an actual gas cooker. Ah, that's so scary. Like an actual gas cooker. Yeah. Okay, yeah, sorry. The toilet is a no. It's not great. The shower. 
I mean, uh, I feel like the, the place I liked the most was the first one. Like the first place we looked at, I think that's where, like. Yeah. Oh, this is a deep red, okay. The place looks really neat. It looks really neat. Yeah. Oh, it's an old house. Sorry. Oh yeah, it's just it's too dark. I know there's no light, it's too dark. Yeah, I like, you know there's some spaces that it doesn't have to be bright or there to be, do you get? Well, the wardrobe space is beautiful. Wow. Wow, this is nice. For real. Yeah, this is a place that if I was investing money in people's houses, I would definitely want to like. Yeah, exactly. Because there's a good space. Yeah. The bathroom too is good. Like the wardrobe, perfect. Is it that like new houses now they make them smaller or something? Yeah, because like this now with the space and it's not a new house. Yeah, it's not a new house. Hey besties! So y'all know I went for the house viewing, the house hunting the other day and I was just checking out places and one thing I noticed is new houses because I actually I don't like new I don't house I don't like houses that people have lived in especially in Nigeria, because from my experience, whenever people leave a house, they leave it very badly put. And then the people that want to then sell the house don't even try to clean it or try to make it like durable. So it starts to look like an old house. So I was really looking for houses that people haven't lived in, like new houses. And the first house was like a great option, but it was just so small. And then it was like on the third floor and then it was like an apartment. So it's not like a semi-detached. And you know, like I was just literally just yesterday, I was just thinking about it. I was like, should I move? Should I stay? Because I was like, okay, they should send me more options. Let me see if I like what they send me. And yesterday, when I was about to sleep, when I was about to sleep, or maybe in between my sleep, I think in between my sleep, like, because I usually wake up and go to pee. So during when I, I wake up, I always either have like a thought or like a song or like a saying. Like, it's like, I don't know how to explain it, but it's like God is talking to me most times during that time because it's like i could be sleeping then i wake up and i go to pee and between that time of me still being sleepy something enters my brain and then i wake up with that same feeling in my stomach or with that same song in my head or with that same thing in my head so i woke up and i'm thinking doing uh, uh, doing it now i actually had a thought like should i leave like how about i just stay how about i just stay like i have plans like i actually have plans like do you get what i mean so i'm like moving we're moving go with the plans out for myself and the plans I know God has for me. And I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking. And I'm like, I don't know. And then I was like, do you know what? No, nah, I'm not going to leave. I'm just going to stay. And yeah, so I'm going to renew my run. And then a friend of mine came. My friend just left. and was like, your room, your room is so like nice. Why did you want to move? And I was like, yeah, like, I don't know. And my friend was like, don't move. Like, stay. Like, put money into this house. Make it nicer. Make it your space. Just you know like go in on the money because i'm someone that doesn't believe in like spending money on someone else's house like if i rent a house i didn't buy it so 
Why should I spend so much money redoing this? Oh. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> You've been gone. Ready. Yeah. Nice. Hey, girl. We out on the Here. Friday night. <laughs> <laughs> After learning the lyrics for how long? Period. <laughs> hey guys, so we're here at Shiro. It's been an event. It's been a day. We've had fun. We had fun. Now we're just waiting to go into the show. Ooh. Like, Period. Ooh. hi besties um i think we need to catch up on like stuff because we just need to uh, anyway um so let's start with some good news i don't really know but if you guys know which i've not really shown you guys but my old ipad cover was so where's this noise coming from now it was so bad so a friend of mine got me a new ipad cover and i'm like super happy and it actually holds my apple pencil so my old one couldn't hold my apple pencil which is like dreadful but it holds my apple pencil it's just so nice and the case is strong it's really nice the way i'm doing it is like i'm promoting yeah and then i put the sticker from the ashlocks thing it says this barbie is a ceo so that's good news then uh the little things like this make me very happy <laughs> so on saturday i'm getting ready for my friend's birthday dinner i don't actually feel really traumatized because this is the second time it's happening in a month and i feel very traumatized like i don't even know how i'm in this room right now i don't want to be here right now my friends are just telling me like i i really hate this nose and i can't find my mic i think i said it before i can't find my mic that's another thing i need to look for but um, my friends are just like, it's not going to come back, whatever. But the bird that entered my room the other time literally came back. And I don't know if it's the same one, but, um, and the last time someone came in, checked, they saw a broken window. It wasn't like big, but they fixed it. They fumigated a bird fumigation, apparently. And for it to come back, is just scary. I was usually applying my mascara on my makeup table. So, um, the back. I could see a reflection and something passed me. I thought it was a fly. And I'm like, how come, how come I can see a fly in my mirror? Because the fly shouldn't be as big that you would notice it in your mirror. So I turn. I'm sorry. Like, oh my God. And I see this bird hovering around the my door. Literally by my door. And I'm like, oh my God, not again. And I was already done. I was applying my mascara in the mirror. So I was like already done my makeup. I hadn't worn my clothes. And I literally just like. I was like, oh my god. So I had to like, I was shaking, trying to see what's up. And then the bird is flying really fast. So it flew towards him and I ran to the door, opened the door and I ran. And um, my neighbor's house boy came in and killed the bird. I didn't even look at the bird. Like, I literally didn't want to look at the dead bird. Like I couldn't even see it. But a friend of mine was like, I should have seen it or taken a picture because they really want to know the kind of bird it is and what, where it's coming from and everything. And it's just so scary because I have been deliberating. You guys know if I should move or I should stay um 
and like so far my house is like the best option i've seen it seems like a lot of modern houses are like really small and i don't like small spaces i have a lot of things so like i just can't deal with that and then the price are really spiked so i'm like if i'm gonna pay the same thing might as well pay the same thing now i keep my house with all the space than to move to a smaller house i'm paying the same money or even higher because of like um, electrical bills and stuff like that so I've just been deliberating God at this point at first I, I was like okay it's a sign I have to move and then I now my mind felt calm and like, okay I should actually stay because this is a good place I could use for my benefit and because of my business like it's just enough space for me to be able to get things done and um and for this to happen again I just don't know why I'm scared I don't know if I'm going to sleep here tonight I don't think I can I would I don't want to sleep anywhere else I don't want to go to anyone else's house but like I just have to like I seem like I have to because I don't I don't know how I'm gonna sleep here but I couldn't nap I couldn't close my eyes like I was so tired but I couldn't close my eyes because even as I'm here like I'm just like looking around like a bird is gonna just fly in and it moves so fast it looks like a fucking bat but a friend of mine is like it's not a bat sends me pictures of a bat and I was like that can be a bat but I'm like it can be a very small bat like I'm thinking babes I just don't know at this point I'm literally like I'm literally traumatized. I'm sorry. Like, I literally don't feel good, but I'm just trying. Put all your stuff away and check out for the day. There's no time to waste when it's 100 degrees. Burns under my feet. Won't you have a drink with me? Oh, Jesus. 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 Oh, Jesus.